This program is brought to you by Emory University. So now your text is gorgeous, but you've decided to add some images to the page that you just edited. Before you can put an image into your page, you have to upload it, just as you would any other file. You can learn more about this in our Uploading Files video. In addition, make sure you've resized your image to an appropriate size for the web. For help with resizing, you can go to ESIT in the Woodruff Library. For information on appropriate dimensions, contact us at collegesite at emory.edu. Now, back to the fun stuff. To get started, you must be editing a page. Next, click close to where you want the image to appear in your WYSIWYG. Then, choose the tree icon at the top. Generally speaking, since you already uploaded the image file, you will choose the internal option. It's best to use images from within your own site, as outside images could change or disappear without warning. Next, click on the small reddish square icon. This will allow you to browse to your Images folder, which, as mentioned in the Uploading Files video, should be underneath the Assets folder in College Sites. Click on your image file, Confirm. Before you hit Insert and put this image right into your page, there are a few more fields you need to complete. First, include alternative text that briefly describes the image. The numbers within the width and height fields are the actual size of the image, and you should not resize the image within Cascade. Next, choose the Advanced tab. If you want the image aligned to the right or left of your text, change the option in the Alignment drop-down. If you leave alignment on default, your text will not wrap around the image. If your picture needs a border, we recommend one. If you want to add spacing around the image so the text isn't right up against the image, you can enter values into vertical spacing and horizontal spacing. We recommend entering at least a 10. Finally, hit Insert to put the image into your page. If you need to edit this image later, either to replace it or change its alignment or spacing, you can just right-click on the image. or click on the image and then click on the tree icon. Don't forget to submit your changes or they will be lost. Also, keep in mind that the WYSIWYG interface is not exactly the size of the content section you're editing, so be sure to preview your page before you publish it. The preceding program is copyrighted by Emory University.